Now, guys, it started raining on me before I completely got everything done. I still wanted to show you a gear loadout, but aren't I glad that I decided I was going to bring a tarp with me no matter what. Now, I did know it was going to rain today, um, but I wanted to test out the little tarp system. And at least everything is, all the, all the cord is tied where it needs to be tied. And all the little doohickeys are where they need to be. So the next time I pull this tarp out, I won't have to go through all of that. Um, it's just big enough to keep me in the backpack and the dog dry. Now normally, it's only supposed to rain for a few minutes. Um, so I'll just wait it out, have a cigarette, have a margarita. Um, I did pinch, pitch the tent and the tarp a little bit too close to the fire pit. <laughs> now I had planned on using, I had not planned on using their fire pit. I had planned on using my own, but it's still a tad close, but I think we can work it out. Um, but I realized a four by six awning really isn't that big. Um, I envision being able to sit under here with the little fire bowl with me but i realize now that is just not going to be an option so i may want to rethink the size i may want to go with still nylon um maybe instead of putting it under my tent maybe i'll use it for a tarp i don't know but at least i've got it um i'm glad i did this now so i could have some time if something needed to be redone to redo it but in the meantime have you seen my view can you, can you see that? Yes, it's gorgeous. So in the meantime, I am just going to sit here and wait it out and chill. I'll be back with you all. As you can see, I am getting ready to start a fire. I found if I gave up my chair and sat on my sick pads, I actually had enough space under here to go ahead and have a small fire. Now right now it's chilly, not incredibly cold, but it's chilly. And it's like the perfect type of fire atmosphere. Um, um, it's The rain is coming straight down. So right now I am actually just fine. I, but I just covered enough for the rain not to put it out. But look at that baby go. I had a friend um, drill some holes in the part that sits on the ground um, because there wouldn't have been any airflow. And so, you know what? That was the right thing to do because this little thing is actually doing pretty well. So I hope it stops raining at some point so I can actually cook dinner. But right now, it's a soggy day. And I really... And I am glad I decided this was one of those luxuries I absolutely needed. Because for my own peace of mind, I did need it. And I'm, I'm glad that I did it. And yes, I'll eat the weight of the pole. If I have to leave clothes home, I will eat the weight of the pole. 